Hey, love bugs, it's Ross. I'm back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and highly favored, and I definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, much love to you and welcome to my returning subs, my grown extended family. Thank you for the beautiful vibes, the beautiful comments that you leave. And then, you know, you're helping out, you know, other people. And you let me know all, all the light work you've been doing and all the positive changes that's been coming in your life. And for that, I'm so grateful for it. And with that being said, much love to all. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light. And many blessings are definitely coming your way. And if you've been watching my videos for a while and have not already, what are you waiting for? Like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. And if you feel like you're comfortable enough, go and drop me a line or two. I would love a chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me or even if it's about the positive feedback of the video or you are just letting me know about your empathic gift that has been placed upon you and how has it affected your life or impacted your life and if you feel like this video has gave you good information or even put you in a good spot of understanding go ahead and pass the word on give me a thumbs up like and even share it's all greatly appreciated and thank you so much for coming to my channel today and stopping by and i hope you were able to resonate with the content of my video and the peaceful beautiful music i'm listening to um is 639 hertz pure positive love energy miracle tone healing music heart chakra soul figo frequency and i will post that link in the description box below and my video today is about twin flame 101 all impasse remember the best things come from tough times, tough uh difficult and tough times which is very true and i know people probably see this you know this, this the you know the title of this video I'm like rise when i'm not even about to watch this because i know sometimes people don't like hearing it which is true because there are so many things that we can go through when we might be upset at that time and just you know I, i've told y'all my life story you know if you're just watching you know there's videos that you need to catch up with <laughs> That, you know, I've, I've opened up to the world about the things that, you know, have is impacted me in a very traumatic way. You know, I thought I was going to lose my mind from. But it's by, brought by so many positive changes in my life. It's brought me to the person I am today. It's brought me so much confidence and self-love that I have for myself. You know, even though we all fall short on going through what we go through. Because it, it just depends on the traumatic experience that you have have had throughout your life and you know and how are you able to to set those those negative impacts out of your life how are you able to heal from the things and grow from the things that you have been through be able to impact some like the next person's life with your story be able to have them look at life and you know things in a different perspective you know um it, it can be hard at times when you go through things and it can be frustrating it, it can it can play with your faith it can play with your patience which i already know i mean there's days when i can look at the situation i'm in and it, it could be the people that are even in my life i'm like lord please hurry up and take me out of this hurry up and take me out but i know there is a purpose behind everything that i go through you know, even where I'm, you know, I'm not like, okay, I'm not where I want to be at. But it could be always a lot worse. It could always be a lot worse. You know, I say I try to put out as much positivity as I possibly can out into my life, you know, um, and then others, regardless of what the feedback I get back. You know, you always, you know, and it's hard to do is to turn the other cheek when somebody does something to you. You know, you want to get back at them and say, hey, this is not fair. Why did you do this to me? But, you know, people do these things. You know, we go through these things because it's, it's like they were meant to be in our lives to bring some kind of dramatic change, whether it was good or it was bad. You know, even the experience we have is supposed to bring back, you know, bring on a dramatic change, good or bad. You know, it just all depends on how you look at it. How are you going to deal with the things that you've been through? Are you going to just sit up here and be a product of the things that you went through? Or are you going to use it as a tool or a stepping stone to get where you need to be? 
because that's how you need to look at it. And a lot of people don't like that. You know, it's just like, Robin, how are you going to sit up here and say the things I went through was positive? I never said the things that you went through might have been all positive. No. But it's just the things that we went through when we want somebody to come up and save us from the world. But we, we have to turn around and save ourselves. That's when we find the strength in ourselves. That's when we have to maintain on tr faith and trust in the universe that they have our back. And knowing they didn't bring us out this far. We didn't sacrifice and leave these things for no reason. You know, it's just like, you know, I always say to myself, oh, if I do this, I'm going to be without this. Or if I do this, I'm going to be without that. And, you know, and it's just like things are taken out of our lives for a specific reason. And it might be, you know, you might feel like you're being punished, but it's like we have to take away the bad things out of our life or the universe has to snatch the things out of our lives because half the time we won't do it ourselves, even though when we know we need to do that. And we try to understand why is the universe punishing me or why is God punishing me like this. They're not punishing you on anything that has happened in your life. And I know there's a lot of things we might not understand on how the way the world is. But sometimes it's not meant for us to understand that they, you know, things we're supposed to just try to understand ourselves. You know, it's just like you might be able to resonate with somebody else's story but you might not completely understand the next person's story sometimes it's not even meant for you to understand that next person's story but it's just for you to understand the message that comes across it so it's just like you have to dive deep you have to look when it comes to things that are being entered and exited your life you have to be able to know why are they there why are these things happening you know and sometimes we might not know all the single every single time we know the reason why we go through the things we go through but it will bring about a positive change you know and it's just like you know we could go through something and it's like oh i hate the fact that this person did this and this and that 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 to me but then when everything blows over you're able to get through them because even though you know it, it takes time to get through certain things you'll you'll be blessed and grateful for the fact that somebody didn't come and race and save you or you know come and take you out of it because it's just like when we want things like that we don't get the lesson behind the things that we're going through and it's just a lot of times it's like when i go through stuff i, I try not to ask for too much help i want to be able to solve the things on my own i want to be able to do things on my own because it was like at one point in my time and in my life where i was very independent i found you know even though i am independent right now but there's just certain limitations on my life that you know has been placed upon me but that's okay. Everything happens for a reason. It's just like we're limited on certain things. And it's just like, you know, where I get upset, especially when I was going through sobriety, I used to get upset saying, you know, when I used to smoke marijuana, the marijuana took the voices away. The marijuana took the stress away. And it just took the pain that you don't want to feel anymore. But it was an actual escape that's all it was for me you know people with different addictions that they have to get through their days of life and it can be hard at times and it's just like when they these things get snatched out of our lives they're for a good reason you're you're able to think clearer you know you're not you know with me when you smoke marijuana sometimes it gets you on that higher path but then you have that you know that side effects of paranoia or sometimes you know, can get to that point where it can have you thinking negative thoughts or bringing out positive I mean negative energy but it just basically depends on how you use it you know because a lot of people I know they're especially empaths that you know they smoke weed they, they smoke it smoke it for pain situa uh, situations or depression you know they help out a lot of things but when it comes to our spiritual growth even though I hate to admit it it slows down our growth it really does and it, you know it takes away from the blessing you know the things that you need to heal from because it's an escape because you, you even though you think it might be helping your problems or whatever but you know the problems are going to still be there once everything you know once that high is gone so it's just like we have to be able to learn to be able to get through things without a certain crutch or you know people that we depend on it's good to depend on people from time to time but you should be able to do things on your own when you need to and I mean sometimes that can be hard especially if you're in a situation 
that, you know, you need to rely on somebody. But it's just like with me, you know, I just try to, you know, do my best. If I need help, I need help. But, you know, there's times that, you know, sometimes it can't be helping you need a good uh, lending hand. But, you know, just know that everything that you go through brings by a positive change in your life. It brings by a positive perspective. It's just all with how you look at it. So I hope you were able to get something out of this video, you were able to resonate, uh, like and subscribe, you can hit that notification bell so you know when your girl's about to upload the next video. And drop me a line, so I love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me, if you're opening up, um, send out as much positivity and love and light as you possibly can. And give me a thumbs up, like, and even share is also greatly appreciated. And send out as much positivity as you possibly can, knowing you are blessed and highly favored and truly loved. And know there is always somebody out there praying for your better days. And I will see you on my next video, and you have a blessed week.